Nobel Prize laureate Kip Thorne was a scientific advisor to the 2014 movie Interstellar, and among other things, he helped to create the black hole seen on screen. However, in 2019, scientists revealed the first image of a black hole, which did not look like the one on the movie. This was Kip Thorne's explanation. Okay, now let's look. This is the image in the movie uh, Interstellar. This is uh, the actual image that was actually uh, made by uh, the radio astronomers. And they're not quite the same. I've had a number of people email me and say, gee, you really got it right. We didn't get it right at all. There's no crossbar here. And it's brighter on one side. We're not brighter on one side there. So what's going on? So the camera for the movie Interstellar is near the plane of the disk, and so that's what it looks like in Interstellar. But we're going to move the camera up to the North Pole and see what happens. It's pretty obvious. You lose the crossbar. And then you blur things out because the radio astronomers don't have very good uh, angular res resolution.